Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. Today we're at the shop once again, always. I mean, because this is the new home. This is where we're gonna be doing all of our future projects at. Damn, someone's busting down that road. Anyways, we got the 435 here, but today that's not what we're working on. We do have so much mods. I wanna show you guys something that's pretty sick. These are two out of the three rolls for three cars that we are wrapping on this channel. This is another package from Keys Motorsports. Got a lot more packages coming in. I'm telling you guys, when I said that I ordered, I think I got like a total of 20 orders. I just went all out, got a new credit card, <laughs> it went all out. Am I responsible? Yes, because I can't afford to pay it off. So do not use your credit card if you can't afford to pay it off. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead, wash the 435 because water is free here. It's kind of crazy and uh, I always like taking advantage of that. Make the car look all clean. Some of you guys are telling me do not wash it every single day. I don't wash it every single day. I wash it like every three days, but the way the videos are placed out, that's just how it is. But I wash it every three days. I think that's pretty fair. I know people wash it every single day. But yeah, I want it pristine clean. Jonathan finally brought the E90 here. I think it's the first time I ever saw it here. I brought it here once. One other time, <laughs> right? Second time. Second time, and uh, we're still trying to figure out, before we even left on this trip like a couple months ago, <laughs> I got it fixed at a shop, and it's still like not working. I'm trying to figure it out right now. It says it's the cat down here. The yeah, like it's not up. checked. I, I don't know what's it's wrong. It's not readying up. Yeah, so maybe I need to replace the cats, or I, I don't even know. Did you say there was a rough idle, or no? It, when I started it up today, it was like, when I was driving it, it was a little bit rough to drive, but yeah. otherwise it's fine. So yeah, we're still trying to figure that out. We're gonna go ahead and put in the code here. Maybe we can get a code for the exact issues. So let's go ahead and get Carly, put it in the car, figure it out, and then go ahead and wash this car, and then, <coughs> and then head on our journey. I know we are super stoked. Guys, this is gonna be legit. Like, we're gonna have lifts. Lifts, I tell you. Like, we're actually gonna have two lifts here. I can finally, finally not have to wear the jankiest clothes because I'm not getting on the ground anymore. I can actually stand up, put some gloves on, be a professional while doing my work, so I'm super stoked on that. We can start doing our own exhaust systems, we can start doing our own welding, we can start doing our own engine pans, our own everything, like everything top to bottom, engine swaps, training, clutch replacements. We can finally pick up a build that has undercarriage damage. Like we are, We're super stoked, so I hope you guys are too. We're about to head out at 3 p.m. sharp, so me and Jonathan are about to just do a few things in my car, his car, get something to eat, and then head out straight there. Maybe get rid of all this garbage, probably we're gonna do that as well. But yeah, we got a lot of things to do today, so without further ado, let's go ahead and help Jonathan out. All right guys, so we went ahead plugged in the new car adapter this is the universal one which is pretty cool let's go ahead figure out what's going on here and by the way this is not a sponsored video they, sh they should sponsor it should. but 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 they didn't so I i'm always using carly because i love them let's go ahead and see if i have jonathan's car saved here the lighting is so terrible so we're just gonna go ahead and run a quick diagnostic and start diagnosing so so far it's reading out seven codes could be some minor stuff uh saying no engine things so it doesn't have any engine fault so carly is saying that he doesn't have any engine faults which he doesn't because it doesn't even have a check engine light so it is saying there is some communication errors that's what we noticed that carly mentioned we're gonna go ahead and contact nick real quick see if he can help us out with that and figure out what is going on with jonathan's car because we're starting to think it could be a, uh, an ecu issue possibly So uh, that, that's, I, I know this is how the video starts. It starts somewhere and we're trying to get somewhere but then we end up getting something to eat. <laughs> Let's go eat. Um, so I realized guys we already ate and I forgot to record it. Hey, you guys already knew probably what I already got. <laughs> Damn! Guys this is so bright during the day. How are you feeling Johnny? Back to the shop and get the I know, right? Let's get to it. We are finally back. Um, you know, just a little something, something with all the beamers and shit. 435. We got the, all these other BMWs. Like goodness gracious. And then we got, and then we got Devon. Devon and his uh, his monstrosity. Hey, buddy, what's going on? <laughs> Look how sweet he is. <laughs> oh, no. Damn! Look at all these cars. Goodness gracious! It's literally like five BMWs right there. Six. Genesis, Genesis. The only two cars we rock up in here. <laughs> Hyundai and BMW. <laughs> wow. So this is what John just made. I actually like the way that he did this, the whole fitted in black. I think it looks super clean. Um, on the Genesis, it's like super flashy. Yeah, so um, that's definitely a BMW's type of person taste right there. I like, I like it a lot. It actually looks like part of the lip, which is really nice. And then uh, they're putting on the rods right now. So that looks dope. And you're also doing the rears, right? Oof, so, oh, you did those too? Yeah. Dang, side scale, dude, okay, this is a must. This is actually perfect. Look at it. No, yeah, it's perfect. It actually looks like without a wide body, it works perfectly. This is gonna be making a fuser, probably when we get back, right? We're gonna head out right now. 
Guys, I just got this water bottle out of the fridge. <laughs> <laughs> what is going on? So we're here at uh, pretty much whose shop is it again? Roscoe's. We're here at Roscoe's shop. Uh, basically, that's where we're picking up the lifts. We're gonna go check them out. He has a few nice cars, so we're gonna be checking those out as well. And then we're gonna head inside. Uh, so yeah, we'll see. I'm just super hyped to see the new car. Super hyped to get the lifts on the truck. For look, look at this trailer, dude. This is pretty legit. It's legit. This dude. is pretty. This is pretty legit, dude. This is where I got my photos. Look how nice these walls are. That's actually. Yeah, I brought sick. my camera for this. Dang. Guys, so yeah, this is uh, Roscoe's crazy collection of cars, like. E30 M3 over there, all kinds of, you know, 6 series, 8 series, all kinds of stuff. He even has super classic cars, Hummers, G-Wagons, Ferraris that have no wheels because, you know, screw it. And not to mention, he loves his Porsches. So he's got a bunch of Porsches. <laughs> so many Porsches, I can't even, uh, I don't even, I'm not a Porsche person, but literally this whole, this whole row is just Porsches. These things are massive. What the heck? We can actually put like two cars. We can literally, we can actually, we can fit more cars now. This is sick. These are massive. Oh my God. So how are we gonna get this on the trailer? <laughs> Who's gonna carry this, Devon? Let's go. <laughs> Guys, I've always wanted to get one of these on the channel. Just the price of them, I don't really know. I believe this is an 8 series. This is an auto. Uh, I don't know how I feel about that. 850 Ci, which is the, this is, if you were gonna get an 8 series, this would be the series to have, but automatic. This one he's had it from a long time ago. This, this is pretty nice. What is, I know this car is like a pretty rare car. I don't mind actually pushing that as well. I know I'm gonna get shit for this for not knowing what this car is, but I, it's a Shelby, Shelby. This is his other 850 Ci, and this one is his manual. I think this is his actual baby right here. I love this car. Only problem is the price. It's up there, it's up there. Is this an M3? Yeah. No, I don't, I don't think it's an M3. Dude, it's an M3. It is an M3. You don't debadge an M3, Jonathan. Only Nord debadges an M3. That's true. Because I'm trying to stay humble, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you gotta put the, dude, it's actually really unique. I don't know how I feel about it, but it's unique. Let's go ahead and try to see if we can get these lifts down. I don't know how. These things are like two stories tall. Dude, this thing is massive. Guys, like little guys, I swear to God, it's like two stories. This is way bigger than normal. Though. This is, this is massive. Oh my Lord. <laughs> he kills himself. Hey, when he's holding his bike, this Alright guys, currently we have one lift completely in on uh... No, we have half of both. What? For real? We have half of each. <laughs> oh, well technically, but I mean, yeah. technically yeah. we have enough of the stuff to build one on the truck. No. Yeah, we, we got the top power. end of this one yeah. in the truck, and then we have the two Neither pillars. Have power, though. Yeah, this one doesn't have power boxes. Calm down. Anyways, we still gotta do the two ones of the power boxes, get it on the truck. We're almost there, almost there. Hopefully. Hopefully we can just get it on there. We want get to get it to the shop and we'll build it into the shop another day because oh, this pretty much took us the whole day. There's, there's no way we're gonna be able to build it today. <laughs> Tomorrow's at a point. Yeah, All right guys, really we are officially down to our last post. Um, John had to figure out the whole wiring situation so we just did a little finessing. Anyways, that's gonna be good enough. We're just gonna go ahead and take this thing down, load it onto the trailer and just get it to the shop. All right, guys, the lifts finally made it to the garage. Um, shout out to Devon's cousin. Appreciate you, my guy. So that's finally here. We're just gonna probably 
unload it over here, and that's it. We're gonna call it a night. And they were probably just gonna head home. I mean, there's not really much we can do today. Setting it up is gonna be an absolute pain, and I'm mean, gonna have to get an electrician to wire it in and everything. So let's just go ahead and unload it, and uh, we'll see if we're gonna be doing anything else afterwards. Guys, we finally got the lifts in here. It was an absolute pain. Devon, I swear to God, if you tell me to set this up, we're done. Go back. Sorry. If you <laughs> if you tell us to set this up, I'm done with you. We're setting this shit up tomorrow. What are you talking about? <sighs> Have a good one. That pretty much wraps it up because honestly, we're not gonna be setting it up. It's just not happening. It's not happening today. We're all super tired. I, it's still early in the day, but I'm not gonna tell you what time it is. So you guys think it's super late at night. That's how it is. But anyways, without further ado, guys, I love you all so much. Remember to stay humble, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Yeah, yeah, let's go. I ain't the first with the curse, with the thirst that I wanna be better, not worse. Man, it hurts. I'm on this earth with my words, and I put them all together in cert, cause I wanna have worth.